unsolved. Zodiac Killer Case. Everything you wanted to know about the car door. This old Volkswagen will be playing the part of Brian Hartnell's 56 black vinyl topped Carmagia in this photo illustration. After the knife attack on Brian and Cecilia, I walked from the scene of the crime to my vehicle, which was parked behind Brian's vehicle. Then I wrote in black ink on the passenger side car door. And you can see from this illustration that it takes only about one minute to write what I wrote on the door. According to this Napa County Sheriff's Report, the car was located 0.7 miles north of the park headquarters, not two miles. After my attack on Brian and Cecilia, the walk back to my car took about 10 minutes. And then it took me a couple minutes to write the message on the car door. Then it took me about 50 minutes to drive to the phone booth in Napa. Napa Police Department, Officer Slate. I want to report a murder, no, a double murder. They are two miles north of Park Headquarters. They were in a white Volkswagen Carmagia. Where are you? I'm the one that did it. Facts about the suspect and his vehicle. The suspect appeared to be heavy set. The suspect's voice seemed to be of a young man. The suspect carried a blue steel semi-automatic pistol. The width between the wheels was 57 inches and there were two different size tires on the front, very worn. Going by the suspect's shoe prints, he had a shoe size of 10 and a half. And then looking at the car door writing compared to the Zodiac's writing, you can look at the A and compare the A's, or you can compare the numbers, one, two, three, and eight, or you can look at other things and see if you see any similarities. This ends this episode of Unsolved, and next week on the Zodiac Killer Case, we will return to Lake Herman Road and the suspects there. See ya.